Welcome to Highway Village. Our currency here is tires, and we sacrifice our younglings to the Lord Asphaltia, High God of the Way. Hey, I'm the youngest one left alive. That means they're gonna sacrifice me to Lord Asphaltia tomorrow. I'm not too excited about it, to be honest, actually. What's up again?
You good, bounty hunter? I'm dying. Uh, oh, thank God. Thank God someone's here. I, I'm, I'm, I'm losing consciousness. Oh, oh. oh my God. What, what, what happened? A G3 base warped right through here. Right, 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 right where I was. And, uh, well, well it chopped me uh, right in half. I got cut in half. A, G a G3 base? Oh, my God. It was probably Dr. Giblets. Oh, God. Oh, God. I'm fading fast. Please. Please, please just stay with me while I die. I, I, I don't want to be alone. I don't want to be alone. Okay, hang in there, hang in there. We'll, we'll stay with you as long as it takes. No, no, it, it's my time to go. Oh, thank you for for staying with me as I die. Oh, just just don't leave. Okay, and I feel it. Here I go. Oh, I'm I'm dead. I'm dead. Oh. Fuck! That rips my heart out. You fuckers ready for Sweezy? Hey, 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 where, where are you guys going? You you promised me... Hey, hey, thanks for coming back. You're not really dying, are you? <laughs> no, 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 oh, oh, I'm dying. No, I'm actually, oh, not uh, for real this time, though. Oh, my God, oh, stay, don't go anywhere. Stay with me, thank you. Oh, here, here I go. Oh, my God. Oh. All right, enough of this guy. Let's bounce. Rest in peace, fucko. Again. Thanks so much. Okay, so is this Dr. Giblets' base? Where, where the hell is he? Well, I'm sure we'll be able to find Dr. Giblets with just a little bit of detective work. Let's look around for clues. Jesus Christ. Okay, okay, fine. Oh, that's a lot of dead bodies. What do you think happened in here? Whatever it was, it's not a good situation for everyone who died. But it's great for us detectives, because we need a good mystery to solve. Now go scan stuff. Looks like your typical work desk, nothing too crazy. Uh, uh, you know, best I can guess is someone interrupted Dr. Giblets while he was doing experiments. I don't know, I'm just throwing stuff at the wall here. Someone was killing G3 mercs. You know what, that makes sense. Everyone hates the G3. I bet people try to kill them all the time. Hmm, a destroyed drone. Looks like it was deployed for combat. Nothing fishy there, that's what they're used for. That's what drones are for, they're for combat. That's not weird to see a destroyed drone. Okay, yeah, I think I'm getting a sense of what happened here. Someone beat us to the punch. They attacked Dr. Giblets and all his men. Oh, we need more information. Let me hack the door so we can go deeper and look for more clues. Haha, <laughs> let's go! Howdy there, cowboys. Uh, oh, shit. Sorry, wrong bit, wrong bit. I mean, howdy there, detectives. Ooh, this looks like the lab where Dr. Giblets did his experiments. There's gotta be something helpful in here. Let's get to scanning. Was he doing experiments on his own henchmen? Jesus Christ, that's fucked up, right? Yeah, that's fucked up. I know it's fucked up. I don't know why I asked. I knew it was fucked up. Dr. Giblets must have been losing his quill. Look at all these drone heads. Dr. Giblets was an expert at creating cybernetic organisms. But we already knew that. You know, I don't think this is a very helpful clue. I do think it's neat, though. It's cool to look at fucked up drone heads. Thanks for showing me this. These must be old Hyperbond prototypes. Way jankier than the ones they're selling at the High on Life store. Well, you know, 
We just pointed these out. Now we can move on to the next thing. All right, here's my new theory. Dr. Giblets was even more twisted than we could ever imagine. He was torturing his own henchmen. He wasn't right in the head. Although I guess that's what Douglas did too, so maybe that's normal for the G3. Maybe he was normal. No way to know unless we go deeper. I'm hacking the next door. All right, I got no fucking idea what this room is, but I'm sure there's more clues in here, so go go find more clues, baby. Are these second place trophies? They're trophies for, for what, science? Just science in general? Do they really give out second place trophies for science? Is that the Gatling we're looking for? They look a little busted to me. Aha, so that's our murder weapon. Dr. Giblets must have used that modified Gatlian to attack his men. It's pretty powerful, did a lot of did a lot of damage. It'd be great if we could somehow, oh boy, did Dr. Giblets write this? He was really paranoid, huh? He really thought people were trying to kill him. And you know what? Uh, he, he was right, because that's exactly what we're here to do. So, okay, he was right. Not crazy. Normal guy. Okay, I think we finally cracked this case. Dr. Giblets really did go insane. He was paranoid that someone was after him, so he killed his own men. While you were wasting time doing detective work, I was busy scanning the area for Dr. Giblets and decrypting the password on his security systems. Now you can just follow the waypoint right to him. Wait a minute, so you had us do all that shit for nothing? Yep, sorry. I just love detective mode so much, I didn't want you to stop using it. Now go kill Dr. Giblets. That's Dr. Giblets, right? Pretty anticlimactic. Jesus Christ, that was the easiest one yet. All right, let me at him. Dr. Giblets status report. No life cells detected. Entering full security lockdown. Oh, no, 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 no! this pre-recorded message, it means you've successfully managed to murder one of the greatest minds in all of super science. Congratulations, you killed me. But I knew this day would come and I was prepared for this moment. Now see if you can survive my retribution from beyond the grave. Another ambush. That's detective life for you. So many ambushes. Everyone called me crazy. Look at me.
It was you, Krubus. What, what is what? He, he thinks Krubus killed him? Yes. Jesus Christ! How many things did he record? Krubus, 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 always complaining about the lowest rung of the G3 ladder. You thought you could kill me and take my spot at the top, didn't you? Well, think again, because well, you did kill me actually, but don't want to kill you back. Christmas, but after all those years stuck behind mountains of paperwork, you finally got to get your hands dirty again, just like you wanted. I really am proud of you, but you picked the wrong dirt to get dirty with. I'm bad with analogies. Krubus, could this actually be about the time that I slept with your wife? And then convinced her to divorce you and marry me instead? And then I made her do an experiment for me and she died in that process? And you swore revenge against her for the rest of the day? Could it be that much? I feel like it's probably not, but I just want to make sure. I know you can't tell me because I'm dead. But soon you can tell me. And how? I said the man to his own. He's got that mic. We need some damn ice break. Just a little reminder, I got some sick ass fists I can shoot. My trick call is ready. Been there, drone that. Okay, I, I, I think that's probably it. All right, if you're still alive, you can't be Krubus. Krubus was too weak. I would have killed him. No, no, you must be someone else. But who was it?
to the house. Good shit. If you're still hearing this, you're taking a long time to fight this wave. You're dead by now. Feel free to die. Please just land. Please just land. Please just land! This must be how space birds feel! As I continue to study these humans, I find them to be more complex than I ever could have expected. Initially, I saw great potential in both the Fergals and the Gat- You know, your holster's not as much fun as you might think. I see how foolish I was. Those were nothing but dead ends. Humans, however, humans are going to change everything. God damn, what the fuck was the G3 doing with this guy? Oh, uh, yeah, well, you know what? Is, is he even alive? Uh, you know what? L let's take him back to Gene. Gene knows. He can fix, get him all fixed up. I just wanted to say, you know, to, today really meant a lot to me. And, um, uh, God, uh, this is so fucking hard. Um, your free trial of detective mode is up. So see you later. Bye. Oh, thank God. Okay, Bounty Hunter, you go through the menus. You find that detective mode. You shut it the fuck off. Never again. Okay, I'm serious. Delete it. J delete it. And if we, if you can't do it, we, we, we go, we go to, you know, we, it's a whole mission. Whoa, look at that. You found Dr. Giblets all by yourself. See?
can't, Peg. I just thought maybe my mom and dad would be with you. Yes, I have tried everybody now. Well, I told her I'd be here before the end of this week. Okay. I'll try not to. Okay, uh, so we did find Dr. Giblets. Um, he is dead, but we also found another Gatlian. Oh, shit. That's great. I, 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 I don't know about that. I mean, he, he's, he's not really functional. I, I, don't, I, don't, I, don't, I don't think he's dead, but... Oh, God damn. Yeah, he's busted up real bad. What were they doing to him? Do you, do you think he's salvageable? Buddy, I'm not going to promise you I can save him. That would be irresponsible of me. You would be careless to toy with your emotions like that. But yes, I can definitely fix it. Okay, th thanks, Gene. But you know, if, if he can't be saved, it, it wouldn't be, uh... What was that? Uh, nothing. I, 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 I was being shitty. You, you didn't hear me. You, I don't want you to hear me being shitty. Yeah, okay. Weird thing to say, but whatever. Sorry to change the subject, but, uh... Turn in your bounty real quick. I've got some good news and some bad news. Okay, come on over. Let me give you the news. All right, what do you got for us, Gene? All right, which do you want first? The good news or the bad news? All right, here's the bad news. Lizzie's been gone for a while. It's probably nothing, and I'm obviously not actually worried or anything because I, I hate her. But, uh, you know, you, you might want to look into it since she's your sister and all. Maybe check with Tweeg. He works at that Space Applebee's uptown. All right, well, I lied, kid. I don't have any good news. I was hoping you'd just ask for the bad news, and then you'd be so upset you'd forget to ask about the good news. Uh, I was trying to pull a fast one on you, and I failed. So, uh, this is pretty embarrassing. Uh, so, uh, yeah, that's everything. I'll work on getting us some new bounty leads if you want to go look for Lizzie. And, uh... I'm gonna see if I can fix up that busted Gatlian you saved. Jesus, that is a lot to take in, Gene. Hey, uh, Bounty Hunter, you mind if we leave the other Gatlians here with Gene and maybe we can go poke around for Lizzie and use that time to have a little chat with each other? You know, just you and me, uh, our favorite people, our favorite, uh, you and I, our best pals. Is off. I look at myself. I may make the world think I'm happy. I can't hide the truth from myself. Okay, listen, just, just, it's easy. Put the other Gatlians down next to Gene, and let's get out of here, look for Lizzie, and have a chat. <laughs> oh, sure, we can use a little break. It's nice to stretch out a bit, you know? Take a little nappy poo. Oh, yeah. Ugh. Change the channel, Gene, to porn. Have a good time, you two. We'll hold down the four. All right, bounty hunter, let's head to Applebee's, and we're, let's find your sister. Look at us, just you and me again, you know, just like old times, like the dream team, you know? Uh, so Applebee's, it's in the slums, which you, you know, you, you probably knew that, so your suit can point us in the right direction. So you take the lead, Bounty Hunter, you, you, you know, we'll talk with, you know, we'll, we'll we're gonna- Bounty we're, we're... Hunter, you look hungry, let me help you out. Hey, listen, I'm sorry about being weird back there, it's just, well, oh, there's something I need to tell you. Whew. This is, this is hard. Just give me a second. Oh, you got this, Kenny. Come on. What are you doing? You're making it awkward. And who could forget this one? Why are you recording me? Get me out! All right, Kenny, you're talking to yourself now. They can hear you. It's not so hard. Just tell them everything. Darren Mindbanger. Everyone, gather around. I'm about to do. <laughs> you, you'd never judge me, right? I mean, we're such close partners at this point, you know? Like, nothing I could say could ruin that, right? <laughs> I'm just just kidding around. Just I'm just joking around. I don't know what I'm talking about. I'm out of my body right now, I think. Two Applebee's in the slums, and that's where we're going. To in the slums.
You know, Gene said Tweak worked at Applebee's, right? So that is, that is a, makes a, it's a good place to start looking for your sister. God, I love it when you stop by. Keep it up, playboy. Broken leg guy still here. See you later. So we are heading to Applebee's in the slums, uh, in the good part of the slums, the space Applebee's in the, in the good part of slums. We are heading there. Oh boy. Okay. So that, um, that dying Gatlian that we saved, let's do it. Let's say we can fix him up and, he, you know, back alive. The thing is, well, Okay, sorry, sorry. I, I'm just trying to figure out how to say this properly, or, or you know, like communicate um, the, how we normally do, right? You know, the Gatlian we saved. Let's do it. Uh, he knows some things about me that 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 the others don't know, and it's, a, it's nothing too crazy, you know. It's, it's okay. No, it's it's bad. It's really bad. Sorry, I don't mean to be cryptic. I'm just, oh, this is tough. You know, this is really hard. I, I just don't want you to hate me. I'm worried about your sister. You, you think Tweak is working today? Welcome to Applebee's. Table for two, right this way. Oh, uh, actually, we're wondering if someone named Tweeg is working today. He didn't show up for his shift, sorry. Do you still want a table? Um, you know what? You know what? Maybe this is a good spot to talk. Uh, yes. We, 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 will, we will take a table. Enjoy your meal. Your waiter will be with you shortly. Thank you. Okay, listen, I I'm sorry for making us sit here at Applebee's. I know we're really focused on Lizzie and that's kind of the important thing, but would you mind if I kind of got something off my chest here with you first? Whew, okay, thanks. You know, it's just, you know, it it's gonna weigh me down if I don't say something. Okay, so you remember what happened on my home planet, Gatlas? It got taken over by the G3, like yours. You know, all my people got enslaved. Y y you remember that, right? You know all that, right? Sorry, of course you do. Well, um, what if it was kind of, you know, just a little tiny bit entirely my fault? <sighs> okay, I, I can see you're at a loss for words. I, I, I know how it sounds. I'm not the only reason the G3 invaded Gatlas. I'm just the only reason they even knew about it in the first place. Hey there, welcome to Applebee's. I'm gonna be your waiter for the day. Can I get you started with one of our signature cocktails? Uh, not, not now, please. We're, we're kind of busy here. Okay, sure thing. I'm gonna go ahead and get that in for you. Uh, thank you. Okay, bounty hunter, so l l let me explain. Gatlas was isolated on the far edge of an asteroid belt. We were completely untouched by the greater interstellar civilization, j just like your planet. But, you know, I, I wanted out. Like, I wanted to see the galaxy. I wanted to see what everything out there had to offer. That's when Rel Del Mar crashed his ship into our planet. He was this crazy smuggler. He, he'd been all over and he'd seen it all. And, 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 and after I helped him fix his ship, he wanted me to be a part of his crew, you know? And he, he took me with him. And I'm back. Here we go. This is for you. All right, now what were you thinking for an appetizer? Uh, I'm sorry. We're in the middle of something, please. Great, it's coming right up. Oh, I don't know why I picked Applebee's to tell you this, but wh where were we? Okay, oh, right. Um, Obviously, a guy like Rel, you know, he had to deal with all kinds of shady customers, and, well, you know, that led us to the G3. And Garmantuous, you know, he'd never seen an alien like me, you know, a talking gun with endless firepower. And, well, looking back, you know, I see how stupid I was, you know? I, I really do. But at the time, I couldn't tell. You know, I was being taken advantage of. I was going nowhere. You know, everyone thought I was a fuck-up, you know? I, I just wanted to prove to everyone that I could do something, you know? Open up. Here comes the appetizer. 
ride your train. Chicka, 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 choo, choo. Thank you. I ho hope you like those. Now you better be ready to order that main course. You betcha. I'm going to get that order right to the cook. Okay, thank you. So, I led the G3 right to Getless. Do you see where I'm going with this? We fought them off at first, you know? But they came back with some super virus that damn near zombified everyone. You know, a few of us were immune. We formed a rebellion. It was led by Les Do It. He was my best friend, my mentor. He was one of the strongest Gatlians who ever lived, and I, I got him killed. In his dying moments, I told him everything, like I'm telling you now, about how I left Gatlas to pal around with a criminal, how I led Garmantuous and the G3 right to our planet, how I got everyone killed, except Les Do It survived. Somehow, the G3 must have kept him alive to try to utilize his power. God, if we can really bring him back, do, do, do you see my problem, right? Like, I, I'm gonna have to tell the other guns what I did, you know, or else he'll tell them. All right, I'm back. Hope those tummies are ready for some yummies. Bon appetit. Dude, take a fucking hint. Can't you see we're in the middle of a thing here? Emotional thing. Uh, you know, this is important baggage shit we're dealing with here. Take a hint and get out of here for a second. Uh-oh, someone's feeling grumpy. Oh, wonderful. Now, wh what the fuck is happening outside? Lizzie? Don't follow us. Twig and I are in love, and we're going to travel the galaxy in his space RV. Uh, actually, this is moving kind of fast. Not Help me, please. that sentence, we're in okay, love. we gotta get to them. Oh shit, yeah, we, I can't dine and dash. I love this place, don't wanna get blacklisted. Oh fuck, okay, this, this, this changes shit, this is bad. I'm here live in downtown Glim City where, as you can see, we've been invaded by violent and agitated G3 cartel forces. No one can say for sure why they're here. We're here to kill you, bounty hunter. This is only a problem if you are that bounty under that they're trying to kill. I'm People Fuckerton, Blim City News. Stay safe out there.
Get caught! What are you doing? We, we gotta get to the house! Kidding me with how slow you're going? Just get back to the fucking house! been here the whole time but, but don't worry I'll keep your secret safe I'm, I'm not a snitch hey you don't have to run everywhere you know you might want to slow down and enjoy the scenery once in a while look at this place holy shit they're fucking everywhere get to the house come on we gotta get to the fucking surprised to see me bounty hunter <laughs> you stole from us, and then let me kill you nice and easy. What the fuck are the G3 even doing here? It's a neutral zone. too critical. I, I, I'm, I'm a pretty go-with-the-flow kind of character, but you need to get to the fucking house! Fucking now! Your house! Ha 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 ha! 
Thanks for coming back for me. I didn't deserve your help. It's not your fault! Well, no, you don't fuck that! It is your fault! You fucked up enormously, but we'll deal with that later. Please, fire up the warp core! We're leaving! Got it. Hey, don't forget about us! What's the plan? Yeah, the warp's ready, but where can we go with the G3 won't follow? I'll handle that! Can you pull off a Hennison maneuver mid-warp to juke them? Can I, what? Do you make that up? You mean scramble the warp? Scramble the warp! Bounty hunter, bring me to the warp core! I was close. I may be 230, but I don't want to die yet. Are we? D d did we make it? Yeah. We're safe. Nobody on our tail, but uh, where are we? Am I missing something? I'm not picking up any signs of life out there. Then we're in the right spot. Kenny, where did you just take us? It was the only safe place I could think of. Careful. It's toxic out there. I set up an atmosphere bubble so you can breathe, so don't wander too far. Or do. What does it matter anymore? Welcome to Gatlas, my home planet. Jesus. I didn't realize it was this bad. Fuck, there's nothing left. This was our home? Pretty soon Earth is gonna look like this too. We have got to stop the G3, bitch. Sorry, nobody answered me. I asked if this was our home. Anyone? Fine, I don't need an answer. God, yes, creature. It, it was our home, and it got all fucked up. We're, we're, we're trying not to think about it too much. Got it. Thank you. Uh, you, you might want to head back. Oh, thank God. The fucking made it uninhabitable out there, you know?
How is it out there? We, we, we don't want to talk about it. That bad, huh? Well, uh, don't get all depressed about it. We still got more guys out there to kill. Let's powwow real quick. Look, I hate to be pushy, but are you ready for your next bounty? You know what, kid? Maybe you should get some rest. Let's save the bounty hunting for tomorrow. Head on upstairs. I'll take care of things down here. I hate to say it, but Gene's right. Let's get some shut eye. We'll make this right Gene starting tomorrow. Strawberry lips cajoles, and like an asp writhing on burning coals. Moist on my lips, and I can lull to sleep thine ancient conscience in my pouch. So this is your bedroom, huh? It's fine. I mean, I don't, I don't, I don't really know what I was expecting, to be honest. And I crush to my dreaded heart, or to their mumbling kisses bear my bust. So frail. So bold, so shy, and so robust that impotent angels damn themselves for me. All right, good night. Right, you're finally up. Okay, let's get back to it, I guess, you know? I, I, I hope Gene has a lead on Lizzie. Let's go. Yeah, look who finally decided to wake up. You know how late it is? Because I don't. There's no sun on this dead rock of a planet. By the way, I got you a little something something. A new suit upgrade. Extra overshield. You're welcome. Let's get to business. I've got something you'll like. You can breathe easy. I'll get right to it. I tracked down Lizzie's bio signal. Oh, that's great. So, so she's... She's alive. Don't worry, but she's on the move. Probably on a ship, so we have to act fast or we'll lose her. If you're ready, just step through the portal door. what I want. Okay, fine. I don't know either. Isn't the sex good? I don't know. I can't even tell if we're doing it right. We're aliens. None of our shit even lines up correctly. You could be pregnant and I would fucking wonder how that happened. My cum goes all over outside of your body. Well, okay. I don't know if it's good either. Your body is really confusing. God, I'm just so confused. Aren't we in love? You're asking me that? Dude, you're the one who dragged me out on this trip. I wasn't looking for anything serious. I just wanted to get laid. But even that turned out to be some weird fucking Hellraiser puzzle. Oh, shut up. Don't blame this on me. There's plenty of ways you could have figured out how to use my equipment, so to speak. Hey, uh, sorry to interrupt. Oh, yeah, thank God. You came just in time to save me. Me is who you came to save. Thank you. Fuck your sister, dude. Woo. Cuckoo. Girls, am I right? Love is tough. What the fuck are you doing here? Uh, I don't know. We were a little worried about you. God, everyone needs to chill out. When have you smoked? What, you're a smoker now? Wait, what is it? Camels? Marble? 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 Marbleos? Marble? 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 Marbleos? Marbleos? I don't know. What's it to you? What do you want? Uh, no shit. Yeah, we're yelling at each other. You want a fucking medal for being able to figure out when two people are fighting? Okay, Einstein. Hey, you want us to throw you a parade or something for figuring out the most obvious shit? Okay, honestly, now it seems like the two of you are getting along. Yeah, that's the problem. Sometimes we're happy together. Yeah, if we just hated each other all the time, fucking, I wouldn't be here. And you'd be playing some rock star game, you fucking asshole. <laughs> But we love each other. <laughs> I don't know. I, I thought this would help. Just us getting away together. My old life's fucked. Everyone else is doing their own thing. I just wanted... I wanted to bang someone on a rocket Winnebago in space. So sue me. Me too, Lizzie. Your body terrifies me in every way imaginable, but... 
Yeah, me too. <clears throat> what? Oh yeah? How? Yeah, how about you just let me handle this on my own? You already decided to become a weird alien killing expert. Don't strain yourself trying to be a dating expert, too. Um, yeah, no offense, but you're kind of butting in, dweeb. Hey, only I can talk to them that way. And look, I'm sorry I dragged you out here. Really, I am. I know you didn't want to. But I just, I wanted to know for sure if, if we worked or not. Oh, yeah, it's cool. I forgive you. I just think, oh, oh, really? Even after forcing you to leave with me? Yeah, okay, it's fine, yeah. Did you know I almost sold you out to the G3? They were offering, like, a lot of pesos to find out where you were. And that would have been way worse. What the fuck, Twig? You piece of shit! Wait, what? You're, you're joking, right? No, I really almost did it. Like, I had my phone out and everything. If Lizzie hadn't dragged me on this trip, I probably would have. I'm not good. I'm a shithead. Lizzie shouldn't be dating me. Gene was right. And it's a little fucked up because he was being a misogynist, but he was actually right. I do suck, and I'm fine with it. That's just who I am, and I love it. So fuck off, love it. Sue me if you don't like it, but good luck finding a judge who'll take that case, or a lawyer, fuck it, you're a fucking idiot. Well, Jesus, I was about to do a, a whole thing about how we should take a step back and slow things down, but you know what? Fuck you, Tweak. Yeah, th yeah, Tweak. fuck you. Hey, thanks for coming to get me, seriously. It, it means a lot. Uh, okay, enough, let's go. You got it. Smell you later, Tweak. Hey, you guys are welcome back whenever you want to come back. If it, I mean, fucking five minutes from now you can come back. I don't give a shit. I'm lonely. We're not coming back, idiot! We're back. You're safe! Uh, I mean... Fuck you. And a fuck you, too. Okay, happy reunion. Everyone's fine. Can, can we just get back to bounty hunting? Yeah, 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 yeah. Clug just sent over the data on Nipulon, so you can head out while I fix Les to it. Did you, uh, know how much firepower this guy's packing? He's got to be at least ten times as powerful as any of you other Gatlians. Wait, you really think you're going to be able to fix him? Yeah. Yeah, I'll probably have them all patched up by the time you get back. Y you're serious? That, that, that soon? Yeah. Don't worry about it, kid. Your friend's gonna be just fine. Old Papa Gene watched a bunch of GooTube tutorials, and now he knows his way around cybernetics. That's, that's, that's great. It's, it's just... What? You don't sound too happy. You know how hard I've been working to save this guy? Fuck. Whew, okay. I guess it's now or never, Bounty Hunter. Can you set the other guns down on the table for me, real quick? Hey, everybody, I, I, I need to come clean about, uh, well, sh this is f way tougher than I thought. Spit it out! Yeah, spit it out! No, I, I, I can't. I, you're gonna hate me. Dad, th we, we don't have secrets. We're a family! Well, hold on. I might decide to hate him. It's okay, Kenny. You can tell us. Oh, just fucking say it. Okay, fine. If you don't hear it from me, you're just gonna hear it from Les Do It when he wakes up. Okay, what if I were to tell you that I'm the reason the G3 invaded Gatlas and enslaved our race? We'd be mad. I, I don't think I could get over it. Yeah, don't say that. You know what? It would really suck to hear you say Kenny, that. Kenny, come on. That's not true, right? No, no, no. That would be impossible. Are you doing a bit? Okay, well, there's, there's more to the story than just oh, a... Fuck, he's scrambling for words. It really is true. He really did cause the downfall of our civilization. Kenny, how? That doesn't even make sense. How can it be your fault? I left Gatlas before the G3 invaded. But but how could that be possible? 
We didn't even have interstellar travel on Gatlas yet. I ran into an alien smuggler who crashed his ship on our planet, and I was going nowhere, and, and, and he took me with him on these adventures, and it was supposed to be, you know, this fun, awesome thing, and but then we got mixed up doing the wrong job with the wrong crowd. Garmantuous and the G3, and I accidentally led them right to Gatlas. It all happened so fast, I, I thought they killed Les Do It. I, I told him everything as I watched the light leave his eyes. I, I didn't know he I didn't know he was gonna survive. You mean you didn't think you'd ever had to tell us the truth. No, 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 that's not it. I, I... Oh, this is all sorts of fucked up, Kenny. I don't even know what to say. See? I'm not the biggest fuck up here. Not now, dude. Everyone, please. I'm sorry. I'm so sorry. I, I didn't know what I was doing. We're so close to taking down the G3. Let's just... Oh, okay. Let's just pretend you're not the reason everyone we know and love is dead, yeah? Sure. Easy. Done. What's next on the agenda? Forgive Garmantuous too? Come on. Th 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 that's not fair. No fight. I'm sure we can all figure this out. No, Creature. He can't just drop that bomb on us and expect everything to be the same. I I'm sorry. Look, I hate to be this guy, but we're running out of time. Nipulon may not stay where he is for long, so I know things aren't... The ideal, but uh, yeah, 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 yeah. We'll finish the job. And then you're out of our lives, Kenny. Come on, Sweezy, you don't mean that. Enough. Just pull yourselves together for this mission, at least. You're professionals. You're bounty hunters. Act like it. Mm hmm Fine. Huh. Okay, yeah. Gather everyone up. It's time to get back on track. Nipulon just flew back into his drug lounge on Port Tareen. So we got a strike now. Can you handle that? She, meanwhile, with strawberry lips cajoles. Let's just get this over with. Writhing on burning coals. Moist on my lips. Woof! That was a doozy, huh? It's just one thing after another, isn't it? I don't know about all that, but uh, I'm glad you got your sister back. Thanks for doing that. That when men I crush to my dreaded heart, or to their mumbling kisses bear my bust, so fail, so bold. Meanwhile, with strawberry lips cajoled, and like an asp writhing on burning coals, moist on my lips, and I can lull to sleep thine ancient conscience in my couches deep. I am so learned in the amorous art. Hey, in the event that I manage to get Liz to it back online, we'll be ready to fight Garmantuous. And for that, you're really gonna need those Earth coordinates. Nipulon should have them logged somewhere in his office, in that big drug lounge he runs. Find those if you can, so he can take the fight to Garmantuous back on your home planet and finish this. Okay, we just need to sneak into Nipulon's lounge. Let's try... Can it, traitor! We'll handle this one! We don't want you selling us out. Kitty, do us all a favor and sit this one out. Hey, stop fighting! I hate it when everyone's fighting! We need to talk things over in a healthy way. No, 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 no. We just need to cover ourselves in goop again. It's not complicated. That's true, we should do that. But I also think we need to have a really fun time at the saloon, so go there first, please. Uh, whatever. It's it's up to you, Bounty Hunter. Head over to Dregtown and get gooped up, or try hashing this out at the saloon. about this whole Gatlas thing? I know they can hear me right now. I know that's sort of the whole rules we set up, but it's still, don't they know? Get ready to fight some local critters. 